everybody, it's your girl Jazzy B, and I'm back with another video. Alright, y'all, before we get this video started, don't forget to like, subscribe, and drop a comment down below. And um, hit that um that notification bell down there so you'll know whenever I post. Let's go. Alright, y'all. So for today's video, we're doing a part two discussion. We got some more topics for you guys that we're about to discuss. Mm-hmm. And you know, every time we get discussion, get in the camera. You are, you're not in right, the camera. Well. <laughs> every time we get discussion, <laughs> every time we get discussion, every time we get discussions, you know, we always get into argument. So mm -hmm. that'd be the best part about it. I love to argue, mm -hmm. especially with her. I love to prove her wrong, but that never happens. So, so he's always trying. You know, I feel like a lot of people is on my side no. in the comments areas. No, when we did the last video. Nah, drop a comment on whose side y'all on. Y'all yeah. on Jay Z B. Jazzy B! Jazzy B! Or you with Riri, yeah. Put Jazzy B. Or Riri. Let us know. Let us know whose side you on. In the comments down below. Now let's I go. Like that. I like that. Yeah. First topic we got are soul ties. Soul ties are basically like you have an item that a uh, an ex significant other gave to you and you still keep it. You, are you? Does that make you connected to them still, or what? That's what soul ties are, pretty much. It depends. Like, if that's not what it was, I'll put a definition down there because I don't. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. You get the gist once we start talking. I, I, I feel like it depends. Like, if it's a necklace, or like, like a like a necklace or something, or a ring, or a watch, you know, something like that, or something that's like meant something. You know, I, I feel like you should get rid of it. Because mm, you, okay. you you keeping that connection like with, okay let's say you you um, you in okay. another relationship and you still got like a necklace you know a ring that that person gave you or some earrings mm -hmm. and he be like oh where you, that's nice where you got that from and they be like where you got that from you got that from that look nice oh my ex gave it to me oh <laughs> hey, you gotta take that off like you not you not about to do that <laughs> you not about to wear your ex's stuff around me like nah okay personally I don't think. There's any connection to it. It is a gift that was given to you. Or you're not with that person no more. Woo -woo, I'm gonna still keep that gift. Like I got two things that an ex has given me. One one I still use, one of them I don't. But the thing is, like he bought me a ring for my birthday. Mm -hmm. I picked it out. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it's after after we broke up, I didn't wear it for a while because I was like, no, I'm not wearing that. Woo -woo. That's true. Right. But you know, I had to I, once I got over it, <laughs> hey. I was like, it's just a ring. I'm about to wear this. It's cute. I picked it out. Thank you. Give me your money. You, you know? sold it. <laughs> nah, man. Like I wear it from time. I wear. It. I've, I've worn it before. Oh. Uh -huh. And then uh, there was a uh, one thing he gave me like for my phone, like to hold my phone up or whatever, some little contraption. Like I still have it, but I don't use it, so I'm probably gonna throw that away or sell it. Uh -huh. But I feel like it's. I feel like. No, I don't like think it would matter. Is, it's kind of different that you picked it out, but like a person, like if it's like special, like that. Like, okay. He made you cry. He made you cry, or when he gave this to you, like a necklace, you know, some just like a, you know, just things that that remind you of him mm -hmm. or her. I'm gonna say. Okay. Like I feel like you should get rid. If you're trying to move on, I feel like you should get rid of it. Okay, so what if you've already moved on? Can't you just like, all right, bet I've moved on. I have no emotional connection. Well, just say when you get a relationship with the next person, and they, I'm telling you, they're not gonna just. Some people, I guess, some people just cool. I'm but say, cause me, I'm, me, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna. You know, your ex gave you that. Like, yeah, so if a girl, if you, if you, if you was with, if you was with a girl, and she had um like some earrings, and ex bought her, you wouldn't be cool with that. You'd be like, nah, you can't, you can't wear that. Depends. It was just some regular earrings, like. Oh, you gonna look at my? <laughs> you gonna look at me and look? Uh, I was about to say you, but I was like, nah, I ain't about to do that right there. <laughs> but technically, you did. Yeah. So. What if she got some earrings with her, like a birthstone in them? Yeah. Or like a necklace with like, um, like, a, like, like a, her initials or something. Yeah, like, initials or something. More. You wouldn't want her to keep it. Okay. I, I just feel like you're not over him. I don't. Oh, she not? Nah. Oh, you not over her? Y'all y'all literally let us know in the comments what you think. Because I think once you over it, you should wear it. Because I think if you're not over it and you still wearing it, then it's like, oh, it's constant reminder. But once you over it, and then you on to the next relationship, it's just a piece of jewelry. But a lot of times. Or it's people, just a piece of A lot of times people item. think they're over it. 
but they're really not. True, and but that's a matter for them. You got to know yourself. You got to know yourself. All right, next topic. Bet this is a good one. All right, here we go. Drum roll, please. Okay, keep it going. My bad, bro. <laughs> Would you stay with a partner if they cheated on you? Can I curse? Oh. It's up to you. No. I'm not staying. Camera right there. Oh. <laughs> no. Do not stay with a person that cheats on you. I don't care they were drunk. I don't care we was on a break. I don't. <laughs> Girl, I don't care if it was a, they was they say oh I was drunk, or it was a mistake, mm -hmm. or like I said, um, that's your favorite one. The breakup. A break not, is literally like what I mean. First off, the, it was a break is for you to cheat. Yeah, it's just to take time. Like if, right. it's a difference between a break and a break. Literally, if a break goes longer than a month, like y'all should just break up. Yeah, for real. A like, break is like a like a couple weeks, like maybe two? a week, maybe a week, maybe I would a say maybe days. two. It depends on how long y'all been together. Yeah, yeah, but it shouldn't go longer than that. If it's longer than a month, sis leave or yeah, bro leave. Yeah, you know, yeah. Not healthy. Nah, right, don't go back to your. You no. Know, so go. you, so you wouldn't stay with a partner if they cheated. No. I can't. I just can't look at, especially for a, a girl. Like, like. Why is it so? The double standards are just insane for you men. <laughs> it is literally insane. No, they literally like, do the same like, thing, and it hurts y'all more. It, it's just like, first of all, I'm, I'm gonna just put it into like the na nature. Like, we gonna keep it a hundred. Women gotta give the man the. Mm -mm. Y'all have the power. It's, okay. It's, right. I'm, I'm you see what I'm saying, though? But what does it have to do with cheating? Why is it harder? Because I'm just saying for us, and doing this and doing that, she mine. Mm -hmm. She my girl. Okay. She go to another dude and let him do the same exact thing that you, that he did, that I did to her. That's okay. A, in, our, in our head, that's like, dang, like, you, like that just, you just, every time you see her, you just thinking of that, that dude doing that to her. Okay, so why is putting that in, putting in work? Putting in work. Okay, but why isn't that? That's the same thing for women. But guys, we can just y'all that testosterone. We can it's just, a testosterone. We can, just, we can just go. I've cracked the case. Hit. Right, it's not emotional. It's emotional. Yeah, for like women. Yeah, for women, some girls just out there like that. Like, most girls like if they cheating, they not having a relationship, and most of the time it's same it's, vice versa. Yeah. So if men cheat, you don't care either. Yeah. That's true. That's my girl. That's my girl. Same way with a girl. It's like, oh, no, that's my dude. And then you went over there and did that to another girl. What? Why would you do that? Why would you break up this happy home? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Wait, but we actually agree on this because I wouldn't take a partner back either. But no, this is what we said. This is what you remember? We wouldn't take back a partner if they cheated on us. Yeah, but we won't but take we will, back. Right. <laughs> Is that toxic? Yeah, that's toxic. toxic. Dang. I but would. I'm just saying, though, because, yeah, I would want my partner to take me back if I cheated. But it's a different other way around. You don't do that to me. Yeah, you don't do that to you me. You don't, like, what? I, mean, I, mean, I feel like everybody do that, though. What? Cheat? No, everybody oh. would be like, <laughs> what? I feel like everybody would, you know, want them to, you know, want their partner to take them back. The circumstance. Yeah, it's a circumstance. That's though. what, I think I would take back a partner, depending on the circumstances around and if, everything. And if I do, I gotta take everything into consideration. If I do take them back, and that's like, if we got like a family. Like we got a mm -hmm. family, we to build something. Right. But like, if I do take them take back, she gonna have to work for at least like a year. What you mean? To get your trust back? Yeah, to get my trust back, but to even get back cool with me. I wouldn't even mm. look at it to say like she got to work hard. I ain't just about to let you. Oh, but you got but a few months later. Oh yeah, you back in. But you got to make sure you are you're willing to be able to get past it though too. Yeah, it's not good to stay well, you gotta, in you it. You kind of got to pray on it first. True. Got to pray True. like should I should pray I, first? Pray first. Yeah, pray first. Pray if first. You, anything. If you, you ever got cheated on and you trying to decide if you should go back or not? Just you know, give it to God. You know what I'm saying? Let him. Let him do all the work. Let him handle the rest. He gonna let you know. Promise. Let him sprinkle whatever he got to sprinkle on that situation. Mm -hmm. Let him do what he got to do. Let him sprinkle anything he needs. He needs to get you right. Mm 
<laughs> Get all your offerings and tides. <laughs> Let them use them pockets, Lord. <laughs> so we on our last topic, and I had we have another discussion. This should be a really good discussion. Really good one, especially for the, especially for the women. What? Okay, you kind of bring y'all down. It's kind of bring y'all down. It making y'all look bad on this one. I mean, low key. I'm gonna call it, low, key. low key make y'all girls look bad. So I wanna see what we wanna see what y'all gotta say, you know, about what these comments but are. But no man could ever make us look bad, ladies. Anyways, I'ma read I'ma read. And, and some of y'all probably know this, y'all probably seen it. It was tweeted at Twenty One Savage had commented about uh, about women. A rich man can meet a broke woman and change her life, but a rich woman won't even look a broke man's way. I got it. There you go. 21 Savage said, facts. Women don't build, they move in. Ladies, how do y'all feel about that? How do y'all feel about that? You need to calm down. <laughs> I just want to see what everybody got to say. Because, yeah, let us know in the comments. So, I'm going to see, since it's kind of going on to the late, I'm going to let you go first on this one. Okay. What do I think about that comment? Hmm. Comment is inaccurate. And it is a... Detrimental, detrimental hit mm -hmm. to um, the women. Mm -hmm. That does make us sound um, heartless. Yeah, no, women, women don't build, they move in. Make it sound like women yeah. don't get their own money, they don't get their no, own bag. We, 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 we stay getting our own money, in our own bags. Okay. Um, you can have a bachelor pad for all for the longest time, but that woman is gonna come in there. We gonna build that empire with you. First of all, we okay. gonna build that empire with you. Lebron ain't get that by himself. Lebron ain't get that by himself. What about Jay Z and Beyonce? What you she mean, Beyonce, Beyonce? Beyonce, Beyonce, she showed Jay Z it. had his own money. Showed it. Showed so it. So what he's saying is he's saying like, like a rich woman won't take in a broke man. If I got money and I got this girl, she she ain't got no money. I don't mind taking her in. Uh, as a man, we're natural like providers. So I, that's why I think like he, like when they talking about like we're natural like. We supposed to be in the lead. We supposed to be the leader. So he was a so he was a CEO of a, a, a million dollar company. You said you were telling me that you gonna you gonna really look a dude way if he just yeah just put your mind of a, a a millionaire. All right, I uh, need you for companionship. I don't need you for your money because I already got that, boo. But they gonna be looking to the ways of people that's on a level. Not me. Oh yeah, I'm just saying like people look people look at that like oh shoot, I'm up here. He down here. Mm. Like, why would I want him? I want somebody that's over here with me. So you agree with that statement? Uh, yeah. I, do, I would have to. I would have to disagree. But like to an extent, because I would, I wouldn't be like that. But you don't know, cause you ain't. You gotta put yourself in that position. I'm in that position. If I'm, if, how much money you making? If, how much money you making? <laughs> with that being said, don't get caught up in all that. Cause we we live different lives than these celebrities. Mm -hmm. Okay. They're, they're entertainers. That's what they do. People get stuck in what they're actually doing and try to like, mimic. yeah, mimic that. And that's not. You don't got to do all that. You ain't got to do all that. It's okay to be yourself. It's okay to be different. Don't follow the crowd because in the end, the crowd might start following you. Hey, I like that. Yeah. You know what I'm it takes a strong-willed person to be different. Like. It but if you keep that mind right and you remember to what? Pray. Right. It's all going to work out. God is going to have that for you. Mm -hmm. What's meant to be for you will be for you. Mm -hmm. And right now, you know, people, you know, like, rest in peace to Kobe. Yeah. You know, Pop Smoke. Yeah. You know, uh, and I'm not trying to say, you know, other people are dying too, like, in this world. But, you know, that's the people we know about that, you know, they're kind of out there. Mm -hmm. but, you know, I ain't going to lie. Life is short. Right. This world ain't getting no better. No better. So why don't we just, why don't we, why we can't be the ones to start and try to change the world? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. You know, it don't, it don't, age don't matter. It's by doing little things. Like today I saw a lady, I told you I saw that lady with yeah. a, a kid out there. I don't know if she was playing me or not. 
Yeah. But I, I fed on my heart just to give a five dollars. I gave five dollars. Yeah. You know, my heart was in the right place. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That's all that matters. You gonna be yeah. blessed if your heart's in the right place. Yeah, if your heart's in the right place. You gonna you gonna be blessed no matter what. It don't matter what that person do after that. Yeah. If your heart's in the right place. You feel good about it. God got you. That's all that is to it. All right, y'all. And what's the big thing? Pray. Right. Don't forget it. Mm -hmm. Do it every day. Yeah, every well, second. Uh, every minute. Just remember. Pray. pray. Y'all drop some comments. Let us know how you felt about the video. Let us know how you, uh, let us know. Interact with us. You know? Yeah. Uh, we just like, just like yeah. Yeah. You know, we just make a video. Whoop-dee-whoop. 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 All right, y'all. Until next time, Jazzy be out.